Alright guys, so here is the ferry entrance there. And when I checked the ferry schedule, um, when I checked the ferry schedule, there was a ferry pretty much every half hour. Um, so yeah guys, Amelia Island, 10, 10 miles. Yeah guys, so this is that restaurant here, the Sand Dollar, and it is said to have the largest deck in town. Um, yeah, it doesn't look my, like much, but... Um, it's certainly most likely a local favorite. You're good, brother. Um, So I have not seen a bike bicycle shop yet, but but who knows? Um, maybe there'll be like a car store, like a car parts store, like an AutoZone somewhere. Guys, so there's a uh, look. There's a a very wide and also asphalted pavement. Wow, Pilot Town. Okay, guys. So a little bit of a history trivia here. Okay, so St. John's River provided trade across that's. Access that supported the economy of Fort George Island's plantations. So cotton and sugar from the plantations were transported on river to trade posts. Early Spanish seamen called the river Rio de Corrientas, the river of currents, for its treacherous currents and plagued river travel. The shifting sandbar at the mouth of St. John's River was a significant impediment of ships as river commerce and the St. John River grew, the community developed off Baton Island, which became known as Pilot Town. Pilot Town was inhabited mostly by harbor pilots and sea captains who made their living piloting ships through the currents to the Atlantic Ocean. These men known as bar pilots, <laughs> maybe they had a little bit to drink. <laughs> so the, these pilots known as the bar pilots <laughs> Beer boarded ships and maneuvered them around the river's shifting sandbar and then helped guide them through to the channel up to Jacksonville. By 1877, Pilot Town became a landing used by tourists and visitors to, vi to visit the Fort George Island Hotel and in the attractions. A dock was built to accommodate streamers, steamers to Jacksonville, Charleston, and Savannah. So guys, if uh, if my if my career doesn't ever pan out, 
Perhaps I can come out here and be a Spanish bar pilot. Um, oh wow, guys, look at the beautiful fauna there. <coughs> and yeah, there's a second sign I've already seen, guys, for boiled peanuts. So I imagine um, boiled peanuts is something something of a local specialty um wow look at these houses guys look at that yard and the driveway um anyways guys um so so yeah i guess peanuts are low Ooh, look at all that bamboo guys wow that is some admirable bamboo wow it reminds me of back home in the Amazon jungle there um, in Peru wow yeah there's some beautiful bamboo stalks there guys uh, and it's the yellow bamboo too um, hey see this see guys there's this uh there's this really um, dark cloud hovering over this area here. Hopefully it's not bringing me any rain because way, way up there, it's really clear. Um, so yeah, hopefully we can clear all this uh, mess. Yeah, guys, because I've dried up a little bit, but I don't feel like getting wet again today. Um, Oh guys, look at that beautiful sand there. Huh. On this side, it's all uh, marshes and stuff. Probably without a good deal of gravel, shale, and limestone, uh, this area probably cannot be built on. Um, but definitely I can smell a fisherman's nest net I could definitely smell a fisherman